I'm a rock star, got money in my jeans, sipping walk hard. She pray for my fall, so I flex on it. Alright guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, today I have my mic on, so that's pretty close only because this is really hard to edit. So um, um, today I'm going to be showing you how to do this effect on screen right now. Um, it should be pretty easy. Because you guys are watching the story, obviously. Alright, so first you want to go to... You're gonna wanna go to like right here, wherever they go. You wanna go to one of these areas or something, a box or something. You're gonna wanna go to here, right? Let me just, you wanna, you wanna cut all your clips. I already have all my clips um, cut. So you wanna cut all your clips. If you have music, you have music, but today I'm the easy music. So um, you wanna go to, click on the clip. You wanna go to oh, pat this um thing, but we're not doing that yet. I screwed up. First, um, you're gonna wanna go to this, put it on full. You're gonna wanna press Windows key, Shift, and then S. This thing will pop up. You wanna get this. You wanna drag it like where you can see like the gun, where you want it to be or whatever. And just screenshot it and then perfect, it'll pop up right here. And then you click on that. Right, this comes up, just save it put it on your downloads there the next that so you have this right then you go to import all these clips go to your downloads wherever you saved it click on it bam you have it so you're gonna want to cut zoom up here get this grab that cut that bam and then you do this, just scale it up or whatever to like 200 maybe, or whatever it is, like 25, just scale it up, or you can just go over here and put it set this frame size or scale size or something. So let me just do this real quick. Alright boys, we are back, and... You're gonna wanna go 15 frames. One, two, three. You're gonna go five, three times, so then then shorten it. Other clip you can move out of the way. Doesn't matter about that clip right now. So you have this, right? It's okay if it zooms up as you can see up there. You can change this back to half so it's not laggy. And then you have this. Now we click on this button right here. You wanna go to like 75. You can use this to move around. Boom. Go down. Now go this way. Boom. Go down. Boom. Boom. You'll adjust it after this. Don't worry about that. Boom. And you invert it. You want the feather to be 10, as it already is 10 for some reason. Don't know how it works like that. Then you can put this back to fit, so click off it you have this you're gonna adjust it a little bit right we're gonna adjust it a tiny bit I'm gonna adjust it so it's like the feathers past the numbers and everything so it looks clean all right that's the point of this so we have this you can put the feather down I might put it down to five doesn't matter just adjust it to where you want it to be So I have it where I want to be. Actually, we can make it a little more this way. All right, so I have it where I want it to be. 15 frames and everything. So now you're gonna go to want to get um blur mode curves, blur mode curve, blur mode curve. I don't even know, but I just look up. Need Sapphire plugins. So yeah, blur mode curves right here. Not blur motion. Don't get that. Put it on here. You can close the mask right now. Then you're gonna go to. You can do whatever you want. You're gonna wanna. You can do whatever you want. So Z disk. You want that to be there. Then go this way. And then zoom it up. Right there. Boom. Drag it over here. Bam. Then you can do this, y, um, y, x, 
right there. You can just move it where it's gonna be. You wanna move it where, like, the black thing is, right? So we got it there. There, and then you can add a rotation, which is, like, the best thing about this. You wanna go there. And then, I usually put this at, like, 20. So you're like, oh my god, there's black stuff. Then you go to this road that you put a reflect on both sides. Um, it's bugged. It's bugged, so let's go, but hold on. I can fix this probably. Okay, so I'm back, and it looks like it's broken. So if yours is broken as well, um... You don't have to take off the rotate, you can do this, right? You just need to um, turn up the zoom a little more. Just a tiny bit more. Like, put it up to like. Whoa. Go up to that, and you'll be chilling. See, like, there's no black stuff. Alright, so you're like, oh my god, the mass is right here. No, come on, bro, you're capping, or whatever. It's kind of cringy, but like. You're lying too much. So then, what the heck is that? Alright, there. So you have all this, right? You're like, what do I do with this now? And you're gonna wanna grab all these, press control, and click on all of these. Then right click on them and press bezier. And it makes it smooth. So it's like, bam. So now we gotta do with the path. The path is this thing because you guys are like scared of that. Or whatever. So this, you're gonna go to mask path. You're gonna press yes or whatever, and then right here, and you're just gonna adjust this to fit where it was. All right, so I'll be back when I'm done adjusting. Alright boys, I am back, and I have all the mat. I have the mask set up, as you can see, let's see how it looks. So, some things are gonna be like, you're gonna be like, some some of the parts are not gonna look clean, so you're gonna wanna like, fix them up, so let me check without clicking on it. Like this right here, we're gonna wanna fix that, cause it's not far enough over or whatever. right there too so it's like kind of just gotta do what you gotta do do what you like to do right there as well it's the littlest things but like it'll definitely make it better especially if it's an EC people are gonna be looking at everything but I don't know ECs are for cool kids the heck it's not working there looking for every single thing to be perfect basically in an EC so that's why you're watching this video because you were probably doing an EC and you need help or whatever so you look down here too it's like the littlest things almost done here See how it's like there's some glitching stuff on the screen. Your monitor's not breaking. Don't worry about it. So now we have this. You can't change Bezier to this, by the way. You can adjust the audio and then fade it, but we're not here to fade the audio. But just fade the audio if you want. Just put it down to like negative, like 30 or something. I can tell your audio is, but just, yeah, see, like that. So we have this, you're like, oh, it's black, though, so, like, what are we supposed to do? So you have it all adjusted and stuff. You're going to want to zoom out some, move these as far as they can possibly go down. You're going to want to add one more track of this, so just right-click on it, add track, and boom. So now you can zoom in a little bit. You have this, right, you want to press alt pull up 
all and drag up. And then you're gonna wanna one, two, three. Drag this one. One, two, three. Drag this one. That's gonna make like that little mirror effect, you know what I'm saying? Like right there, you see? It's like mirror mirror effect. Alright. Just keep it like this, don't cut it, it's fine like that. Then you wanna drag in this. I think we're almost done here. Drag in this. Got your stuff. And there. That's how you do it, boys. So, um, thanks for watching. Um, subscribe always, bro. Like the video. Hype it up, boys. On the road to 200, 200 subs. Kind of cringy to say that, but, like, we're on the road to 200 subs. Let's get there by the, by the end of next month, boys. I mean, that's kind of high goals, but, like, this video could blow me up, bro. There's no videos on Premiere like this. Alright, so, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe, all the good stuff, and I'm out. Peace.